So I want to look closely at this curve. You'll see I've got a nice curve drawn here. What we want to do next is draw a tangent line. Now, there's two ways we can do this. We can draw a tangent line or we can calculate. In this lab, we're actually going to calculate, but I want to explain what a tangent line is. So what a tangent line is, is a line that just touches this curve. So this is not a tangent line. Okay, it's not a tangent line because you can see it crosses my curve here and here. It crosses in two places. A tangent line will only touch in one place. So if I could pull that line down to a spot where it only touches in one place, that is a tangent line right here. And if we could find the slope of that line, we would know the instantaneous velocity at that point right there. So we will know how fast something is going at that point. Yes, there is a connection with tangent to your trigonometry unit of math 10 where you learned about sine, cosine, and tangent. I won't get into that here. But that is the point that we're calculating an instantaneous velocity. And you'll notice that as we follow the curve to do this properly, I would have to change the angle of my straight edge here to get a tangent line here to get a tangent line, maybe it's this. And the slope of that line is very different than the slope of the other one.